Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Broken Souls. I have fixed it. We restarted the game. Why? Thank you. I am Vigeland of Katarina. I don't know how I ended up in that crystal. It wasn't terrible in there, but I could hardly move. I must think of some way to repay you. Man, this spear is long. Oh, have you seen my father? You wouldn't miss him. A suit of armor just like mine. Tell her yes. Thank goodness. I knew he was here somewhere. Well then, now I must find him. Thanks again, truly. Oh, if we just stay put and keep out of trouble. Thank goodness. Okay. It should and that's be, all we can do for her right now. It should be fairly obvious who her father is. It should be fairly obvious where we're going. Over here. Over there. Item. Over, over hill and over dale. Over yonder. Over over here and under where? Crystalline armor. It's heavy. I believe it provides def decent defense, though. Testing, I guess. Mm-hmm. It's about time we figured out if this thing will do more damage to these guys than the Moonlight one. Nope. Wow. I know it says it's a divine weapon, but I think this actually does magic damage when it's reinforced with divine. It doesn't do much more damage, though. Try two-handing. 63 is better. 100. Straight 100. And as long as you keep your distance and poke, you should be fine, right? This is way better than wasting all of your spells on that. All you're doing is wasting easy-to-fix durability. Ooh, sugar. Okay, let's see when there's another crystal get him. There's another crystal get him. Yeah, they I definitely are... want to kill all of them because blue titanite chunks. Screw you, Robert. I want titanite chunks of blue. You should probably come back with a better weapon if you want to farm chunks. Yeah, you're gonna be here. Still want to kill them all. You're gonna be here forever and a day doing this. At least you can stab quick with it. <laughs> now you're being ganked by three. Oh, one down. Oh, that does as much damage as a thrust from your Moonlight Great, uh, Moonlight Butterfly one. Oh, when you roll, you do a slash. That's something to remember. Because that'll help you do uh, vertical damage to enemies. So if an enemy is out of your stabbing range, you can just do a roll forward and try a vertical stab. Unfortunately, I'm hoping it even your damage. Jump! Man, these guys are ugly. Yep. I'm trying to figure out what they remind me of. Kind of like the Hunchback. The Hunchback of Notre Crystal? They actually do remind me of something. The Mercury Golem from uh, Curse of Darkness. Do you remember the Mercury Golem? Kind of. It's a game that I'm surprised you haven't done yet for the channel, actually. I haven't done very many Castlevania games. I haven't done any, actually. We, that needs to be fixed soon. I'm certainly not going to do the original. I suck too much at it. Only Castlevania I've ever really played was Simon's Quest, and I don't think I've ever beaten it. Well, I could do it one. It was one of the games I played when I was a kid and I sucked at it. But I really loved to play it. It had really awesome music, especially at night. Do, 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 that do, Bloody do. Tears, yo. Bloody Castle Tears. Do, 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 do. For Castle the longest time, Bloody Tears was actually my cell phone ringtone. I hate the... Then I switched to the ringtone from Saints Row 3. Because uh, the developers released the actual sound file used within the game. And I was like, that's cool, I'm using that. I hate the. I actually like. Thing. I actually like Saints Row Three more than Four. 
Nah, I'm gonna have to say I like them both. For I different like reasons. Both. Four is OP, but I like being OP. And then there's Gat. But the only real problem with it is the complaint that Robert has with it. Having all those superpowers makes all the cars and all of the guns and everything completely worthless. Still like having them. It's really fun. And if I want to use cars and guns, I can if I want. And if I, you know, I can always play three. So you know, there's that. Cash blast the OP. Yo. <laughs> bling bling powers activate. I haven't actually finished either one. I just I lost have. interest after a little bit. However, Gad out of Hell is one that I have not finished yet. Mostly because I like playing it with Robert, and he refuses to get that one. Though the chair is fun. And I'm, he's dead. The recliner of awesome. <laughs> the Child of Doom! I literally can't do anything over here. Of course okay. not. This is not the way forward. The way forward is forward and to your right. Through Crystal the trees. trees. I have a feeling I'm going to get my ass handed to me so badly. Why? The only thing that's in here are more golems. Oh, I figured this was boss fight. No, we've still got a ways to go before you actually reach the fight. Crystal Cave. Welcome to Crystal Cave. There are only two what types of enemies in here. You have... I think he's going to roll off and die. No, he walked off. Well, I was going to go that way, but I'm not now. <laughs> you have the Moonlight Butterfly. Oh, fuck. Where did you come from? Although I don't think they're actually called that. I think they're called something else. You've got the Moonlight Butterflies, and you've got the Crystal Golems. Both of which are obviously going to be slightly resistant to magic. However, the Moonlight Butterflies will not aggro you unless you attack them first, so you actually have an advantage in that regard. <laughs> this works. <laughs> Excuse me. I'll take that. More, more chunk. Don't go that way. Where is the way forward? It's just nothing but a drop off to death. That way. Oh, okay, I didn't even see this. Neither did he. Everything is crystal every day. Pretty much. They don't call it the Crystal Cave for no reason. Apparently, Seath's crystal sorceries are really just that impressive. And there's a Moonlight Butterfly, but you don't have to attack them, so I would suggest not doing that. Too bad I can't get another Also, from stop me. here. What? Go over there, to the left. Look very carefully. Believe it or not, I'm walking on air. Yep, there are invisible crystals around here. Huh. And they're everywhere. Is this where I came from? No, I'm pretty sure this is just the right way down. The other way is just a side path you can take. That's not what I asked. I said, is that where I came from? The correct answer was yes. Yeah, yeah. I said it in a roundabout way. You... Kind of didn't. Yeah. I see bloodstains. Oh, I see bloodstains in midair. Yeah. You see messages in midair. Oh, messages, okay. Oh, there were bloodstains, too. Gee, I wonder what the correct path is. I would suggest running straight forward. Do not deviate to the left or the right. What's over there, though? Nothing. Other than the home. There They're just anything. perched randomly around here. Yeah. There's usually no path to them. You actually Do have they to drop anything cool? Nothing that I would consider worth it. Alright, if you want to tell, the best way to find the path... Is what I'm doing right now. I'm no. looking where these fall. That, there's another way, too. Prism you can just stones. use prism stones, yeah. Hmm. That's what they're for, and that's why... Uh, that's me. Goldie. I don't know why I'm using Hush. You always use Hush. When I have it, yes. This guy's big. Yep. I don't think I want to fuck with it's him. It's also unique, so if you take it out, you don't have to worry about it ever coming back. At the same time, you're on a very precariously tiny, small crystal platform. In other words, don't let him leap.
Man, this guy's got a lot of health. And you're doing very little damage to him, so that doesn't He's help. He's chewing him down. Well, yeah. But that's one of the benefits of having a fast weapon. And a long-reaching weapon. Yep. As long as you don't accidentally kick. You stabbed it in the knee and it flinched. Flashy finisher! And now he'll never come back. You he didn't give me it. anything, though. He gave you souls. Oh, how many did he give me? I wasn't looking. I was thinking more of, like, items and shiz, yo. Oh, whoa, 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 no, 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 no. Roll. Not oh, jump. jump! I wasn't trying to jump! Will they attack you if you just walk up to them? No, they will only attack you if you hit them first. Well, I call bullshit! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, it's time for take two. I would suggest running straight forward. Keeps you from sliding downward too much. I call bullshit. The game killed me. Lost all my stuff. I'm angry. I'm sad. I hate everyone. Was it's there not... something over there? No. no. Oh, I thought I there think was. I think there's a... another path. Yeah, it looked way, like there's an invisible know. path. I don't know where it leads to. It's an invisible path in it. And I wanna I wanna know where it goes and and I want stuff and, and things and sh should I fuck with this guy? No. Only if you really want to. Oh shit. All I did was walk up to you. I didn't do anything, man. Padunk. Did I do no damage? All I did was steal the horn of your brethren. Wow, it's gonna own you if you don't do something. I have been owned! And I'm back again, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm gonna get my stuff back. Some uh, backup commentary would be cool. Oh, sorry. I don't really have anything to say after that really, 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 really poor failure last time. Yeah. Oh, I didn't even have stuff to get. Derp. Okay, I'm going to see what's on this magic path forward. And I got me some prism stones. Ugh. Okay, it's safe to walk there. And over here. And I think whoa. it's just an alternate path forward towards the boss. Uh, Test. This is really, really disconcerting. I'm quiet because I'm watching him. Stupid camera. Keep trying to get in my way. Go away, butterfly. I'm not messing with you. I'm pretty sure that's the sh shadow of one that's ignoring you. Also, there's another red uh, golem. And it's guarding something. Say crest? You can always just run up, grab it, and then run like hell. You're here to get in his face. Wow, look at all that. It, just, it doesn't even flinch. It flinched from the first soul spear. At least you're wearing it down faster than you would if you were just using the horn. Oh, that was lucky. This also means you have less magic for the boss. Well, you said don't use crystal in this boss, so that's why I'm using crystal. Mm -hmm. And Let's dead. See. Which way is the way forward? Which, which way is the way that that would have taken me? Down here. Really? Uh -huh. I'm pretty sure it would have led you there. I'm guessing that says jump here. Or something to that effect. Is this the way forward? Nope. No? Shit, the way man. forward is to your left. But you have to find the correct path to get there. Hell if I can remember where it is. I don't. It's been a good... This is one of the first places I went to, actually. Second, maybe. Maybe you have to go back. Hmm. The way yeah. forward might actually be that path up there, and it just continues up and above. This is so scary. Stupid invisible floors. I'm so glad those stick around. Oh, yeah. What? Yay! 
Okay. We're back. It's tempting you to go across, but I think you should ignore it. No. I'm getting my shit back, even if it's a little bit. I'm gonna get it. It's gonna be mine. I'm gonna be happy. It's for the, uh... Uh... What, what was... What is the thing you said? The principle? Yeah, it's for the principle of it. Just don't die for your principles. That would be awful. Even though principles are good bosses. Guide me home. Man, Bring me back so many to the very nice homes. city. Is it safe to walk over here? Okay. <laughs> now you just gotta follow the path that you created back. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Don't fall, don't fall, don't fall. Don't fall. Okay, I fell. Turn and he survived. <laughs> Alright, you're back. You're a bitch. Take it nice and carefully. I am actually tired of you dying. Stop it. Ask this up. Now, make sure the way forward is... Like right here or right something. Right there, yeah. Just drop down. And then run straight forward. As long as you run straight forward, you'll be fine. Imminent fall. Trust me, as long as you run straight forward, you will be fine. Have you ever talked about how creepy yeah. that is? Whew. Having to walk where there's no floor that yes. you can see? Yeah, it's kind of creepy. Also, oh. if you ever wanted to farm uh, Herging Stones or Twinkling Titanite from uh, Maneater Shells, yeah, this is a pretty good place for that. Except there's no bonfire near here. There will be after you defeat the boss. Just be careful, because I think you've aggroed one behind you. Ow. You're not getting my skull to add to your collection. Piss off. I actually think that would be a pretty cool item to have. A pearl skull. Now, granted, if it was a real pearl skull, that would be kind of freaky, but... If you had just a, a skull made, made of what looks like pearl, I think that would be awesome. Stabby, stabby goes the spear. Stabby, stabby up your rear. I don't think it has one. Considering it's a giant clam, I'd say no. It's a mossel. Look at my mossels. They're deadly. Oh, I got all my stuff back. Yep. Try humanity. Oh, that took most of its health away. Also, it is very important that you defeat all of these guys before taking on the boss. Is the boss room in here too? Ow, fuck, go, no. No, 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 no. Don't go too far back. The reason for this is the fog wall does not appear during your first attempt with the boss. First? Why not? Why only the first? Because the subsequent ones afterwards. it appears later, yeah. But for the first attempt against the boss, the fog wall does not appear, and all of these guys will follow you in there to kick your ass while you're getting your well, ass kicked. Why doesn't by the it boss. appear for the first time? Fuck if I know. So you can run out like a CC coward? I'm not exactly sure. That oh, that was, was an instant death kill. attack. Instant kill no matter how much health you have? Yep. I'm pretty sure it is. I have been killed by. I have full health. Unless it just does a whole bunch of damage and you can somehow ignore it by having a lot of health. Maximum I... vitality. Defense rings to the max. Twinkling Titanite. Good for special weapons. More Twinkling Titanite. I can't even tell when they have one in them. I better just go press the button in front of all of them. It is really hard to see. That's why you gotta walk into the middle of them. Okay, they're, they're good. They're clean. Gee, I wonder if this boss can curse you. Oh shit, I thought those were some kind of shadow enemies. Well, fuck. I free you. Oh, I don't get to free any others. I'm dead. I'm dead. Just remember you take care of that first. What's that? That's the crystal. Remember? The crystal is providing Sethus immortality. Oh. Excuse me. Ah, 
Hunter Dragon and the Crystal. Actually, I think Seath might be blind. Do we want to test that out? I'm pretty sure he knows where you are. Yeah, he can go, Michael. Go, go around. He likes to breathe curse at you. Yeah, he knows where I'm at. Hey, you were on the right side of the Primordial Crystal. How'd you get there? It spawned in there. Oh, did I run past it? No, you started there somehow or another. Oh. So, I shouldn't have run over here. I okay. thought it was behind you. I guess I forgot how the gallery starts. Now, there's a really good trick to fighting uh, Seath. I'll tell you as soon as you break the crystal. Is it one hit? Yeah. Yay. Now, now you can damage him. Run around him in a circle to your left. Well, I'm going to the right at the moment. Well, it doesn't matter as long as you're going around him in a circle. Well, then why did you say left? By the way, tentacles. Man, he is just trying to hit you with that, isn't he? And succeeding. You want to stay in front of him, but running around him. So I don't get tentacles? Yeah, you want to stay in front of the tentacle. Is that going to hit me? Yes, it will. Get out of it. You have very little curse resistance. Because you have no stock you have. You're actually doing more damage to him than the Crystal Golems. I think you should probably just go ahead and use your horn. I can't tell what you're doing anymore. They're actually doing decent damage at this point. Can't tell what's going on. Well, your curse is growing. Wow, that only does 132. What did Dark Orb do? Ah, oh, crap, you're about to get cursed. Oh, he's fine. Oh, good. Oh, that actually did pretty decent damage. How much did it do? 129? No. 194. It's a bit slow. 160 for uh, soul mass. 380 for spear. You only have one heal left. Before you should start pumping humanities in. Uh, heal up. Okay, good. Ooh, you've got him. It's over. That's the right. That was the crystal the though. First try. So cool. Wow, maybe crystal sorceries are effective against him. That is so weird though, because you wouldn't expect it. Bequeath Lord Soul Shard. Cool. See, the scaleless has fallen, and you can pick up an item. What? Over there, behind you. On the ground. Where? Right there. Or where? You can't see it? Oh. Is that a homeward bone? <laughs> if it's homeward bones again. It's a humanity. They are, because they always give you humanities. Or derp. Press it to the. Oh, it's behind you. It's right there. Oh, crap! What? what? Oh, the weapon! What? There's God a boss damn it. weapon. What? There's a weapon you can break off of Seath. Robert, oh. don't overreact. That means we can't show it off for the LP. Unless oh. you get it. Hey, you, you, you get it and break it off and show it. Alright. Well, I'm guessing you break a tail off? Yeah. And I'm guessing one, he can't it? hit you with it as long as you broke it off? Which would have made the boss fight easier? Isn't, I think it's the Come back on, you can break the toes off of every enemy. Why didn't we think of this sooner? I, th I thought of it. I Why aren't you speaking, Robert? Robert? Robert, are you okay, Robert? I'm fine. Seriously, though. I actually really like that weapon, too. What is it? It's Moonlight Greatsword. Oh, that's the thing we were just talking about. You bitch. 
Yeah, the Moonlight Greatsword is a pretty bamf weapon. But does it take strength to wield? It does require some strength, but it's mostly an intelligence weapon. Damn, I would have really loved it then. Maybe you Fuck can stick. Have Robert I'll, break it off if, and drop if it I can you. get it, I will drop it for you. But I gotta make sure I sever that tail. Well, how about I help you for that fight and we can take it together? Well, I'll have to be. Okay, are we done here? Next session, though. Have we got everything? I'm yep, pretty sure Seath we do. is done. Oh, okay. Damn. That yep. is the first of the four Lord bosses down. There's three more places you can go. The easiest of those would be New Londo. Yes. So I shouldn't head for Pinwheel next? <laughs> you can if you want. There's two really close by that you can get. You can go to New Londo. You can go to... Uh, Catacombs is only slightly more difficult than the New Londo ruins, in my opinion. Oh, wait, 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 wait. I know what to do. What? Logan. Right, we need to go see Big Hat. Because now that we've defeated C, things should change. Oh, also, hey. it's Sigling. Oh, oh, I thought it was Sigmire. You guys managing quite well, aren't you? But I haven't found my father yet. Have you seen him? Say yes. Really? Then I must be off. I'm sorry he's caused you trouble. He has a knack for that. If it just stay put. Okay, you can tell if it's Siglind or Sigmire because Sigmire wields the uh, wields the uh, Zyander and she wields the Claymore. And one sounds like a woman. Well, yeah, but, but if looks, you wanted to look, but that was Siglind. <laughs> I mean Sigmire. God damn it, I messed up my own joke. Okay, let's see here. The place I need to go is Crystal Cave. No, the Duke's, Duke's archives. Duke's archives. Crystal Cave was where Seath was. Yeah. And it is a really good place to farm purging stones if you ever feel you need them. And Twinkling Titanite if you don't want to spend the 8,000 souls necessary to buy them from a giant blacksmith. This way. Yes. It's weird not having hair. The headphones are actually rubbing my ears raw now. We've only got two minutes. I don't think we can finish Logan's... Who are you? Uh, stay clear. Stay clear of my work. Curses upon you. How dare you disturb me? Um, talk to him again. Who are you? Stay clear. Curses. All right, now go rest at the bonfire again. Oh, wait, I didn't actually do the thing. Do what thing? Oh, rest at it, yeah. Yeah. So this would take me away. Took me away, took me away, took me away. As you can away. tell, uh, Logan's thirst for knowledge and nothing else has slowly eroded his mind. He's becoming a hollow. Without dying constantly. Yep. So dying constantly is what turns you fully hollow? By mm. having no souls for long enough, your mind will go... Hmm. Wish I could just give him some of mine. Stay clear, I did weird. nothing! Nothing, I tell you. Who are you? Do we have to kill him, Robert? Try reloading the whole area. So warp out and come back? Yeah. I don't remember how to progress this. And now he's going to check. I don't even see it. Oh, it's because of where I'm at, derp. Okay. Let's go to Fire Link. I was hoping I could just re-warp to the same area I was at. Save a trip. Looking up on your fume. That's what he's doing. Hmm. Okay, so go back to the two star guys. Okay. So it says that sometimes you have to quit and reload your game. This doesn't work, I guess, is what we have to do. Now, if he's not in that room, then he's where he's supposed to be. Or you might have to talk to him one more time. Yep, he's gone. You have to go to the room where Seath first appeared, the beginning of the archives. If you want to warp to New Londo to get there faster, you can. Uh, and Orlando. I mean, and Orlando, but you can also get there from here pretty easy. Okay. It's just up the steps and around. Eh, that won't be too hard. And I'll go ahead and do that before we end the episode. Be ready for a fight, though, because oh, now that fight. he's is because now that he's gone mad, he's gonna attack you. 
Oh, okay. He's a hollow now. Ow, bitch. Is this the right spot? Ow, bitch. Yes, it is. Okay, good. You're gonna end up dead if this keeps up. I don't like crystal people. Racist. <laughs> What do crystal people ever do to you? Kill me? They're just trying to show you the native dance of their people. The dance of death? It's called the swords dance. It increases their speed by two stages. Swords dance is not It's not their not fault speed. it also kills you. Also, you're going the wrong way. You didn't even have to aggro these people. Going the wrong way? Yeah. Robert, swords dance Where's the is correct way? Go down there. How did we get that thing to appear? Ow. Man, they are just... They don't like me. Okay, where's the switch that causes it down? That's weird. Maybe it's on the opposite side. Hmm. I know it's here. Not that way. Robert is switch. lost. It's on this end. It's an elevator. But I don't remember where the switch is that calls it down. I think it's right there across the side. Yep, that's it. Got it. We might want to get out of the way. Stop trying to arrow people. It's rude. There we go. Safe. And touch off your health. Don't forget to use that firekeeper soul when you get back to the shrine. Oh yeah. And break this. Just cause. And of course we don't have to deal with the knight that was here last time, because he was a unique enemy, which is always nice. Oh yeah. We're almost there, ladies and gentlemen. Now, if you don't see him up here, you might have to quit and reload the game to get him to appear. Well, he wasn't down there, so it'd be really weird if he wasn't. Need ring. Yep, he's here. Is that him? Why is he naked? Because he's lost his mind, obviously. All right. We're going to have to take care of naked, weird, big fat hat in the next episode. Because this one ended a couple minutes ago. We'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye!